beautiful railway bridge of the Silvery Tay. Alas, I am very sorry to say that 90 lives have been taken away on the last Sabbath day of 1879, which will be remembered for a very long time. Twas about seven o'clock at night, and the wind it blew with all its might, and the rain came pouring down, and the dark clouds seemed to frown, and the demon of the air seemed to say, I blow down the bridge of Tay. When the train left Edinburgh the passengers' hearts were light and felt no sorrow. But Boreas blah blah terrific gale blah de blah 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 quail, blah de blah 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 rhubarb rhubarb safe across the bridge of Tay. Oh. Blah tortured rhyming blah blah rhubarb rhubarb blah de blah blah de blah de blah. Blah 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 flagrant disregard for meter. Blah blah then the central girders with a crash gave way and down went the train and passengers into the Tay. Blah de blah blah rhubarb blah on the last Sabbath day of 1879, which will be remembered for a very long time. Oh. Blah de blah 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 blah, good heavens. The Tay Bridge is blown down, blah 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 how the disaster happened on the last Sabbath day of 1879, which will be remembered for a very long time. Oh, ill-fated bridge of the Silvery Tay. Oh. I must now conclude my lay by telling the world fearlessly without the least dismay that your central girders would not have given way, at least many sensible men do say, had they been supported on each side with buttresses. Blur. <gasps> at least many sensible men confesses, for the stronger we our houses do build, the less chance we have of being killed. Well, what do you think? It's called the Tay Bridge Disaster. William, you're a really nice guy. But I just don't think it's gonna work. Oh? I see. If you don't like railway disasters, I've written plenty of other poems. How about this one? It's called Beautiful Talky. No, William, it's not the poems. It's all ye lovers of the picturesque. Oh, wait, oh, beautiful Talky, and spend a holiday this health for invalids for to go there. William. Okay, you don't like talky, but you will love this. It's called, Lines in Reply to the Beautiful Poet Who Welcomed News of McGonagall's Departure from Dundee. Oh, for Christ's sake, just shut up. But you said in the advert you wanted to meet a poetic gentleman for fun times. I also said I'd like a tall, dark athletic gentleman aged 35 to 40. What about saving a train? It's about a German lad on crutches who gets killed saving a train from a collapsed bridge. What about, roses are red, violets are blue, your poems are shit, and so are you. Well, really? It's got potential. How about... The roses, most distinct to see, shone red in the beautiful flower show of Dundee, and the violets? Check please. <laughs>